to work from home? Oh my God, wait, I have to sit in front of my computer for the next like year? Ah! Hi, this is Dr. Wallace. Today, I'm gonna ask you, what feelings have you experienced during the COVID-19 pandemic? I've, I've felt all these, all emotions possible. It's been one and a half years, I guess. Literally, literally every feeling there is, like all of them, happy, sad, depressed, angry, joyful, I don't know, all of them. Frustration, hopelessness at times, a little bit of hope sometimes, and kind of like, um, yeah, mostly that, I guess, fatigue. Uh, uncertainty, fear, um, and anger to a bit, to a small degree. Small anxiety. That's it, probably. Uh, stress, anxiety, worry, like languishing. Anxiety, um, yeah. claustrophobia, I don't know, because we were locked in for a very long time. Um, stress, Yeah. a lot of stress. What's that saying, you don't appreciate what you have until it's gone? Well, when you're not able to actually socialize and be around people, you know what? And you're locked away for a year? Dude, are you kidding? Dude, I make video games and I bartend, right? So it's like, I'm used to being around people, being around teams of people for a few years, you know, bartending, serving people drinks, you know? When I don't have that, it's like, I have to work from home? Oh my God, wait, I have to sit in front of my computer for the next, like, year? Ah! Uh, depression, <laughs> isolation, um, a little bit of relief from like uh, capitalism and stuff um, and a sense of knowing myself better actually. So like both sides, good and bad, balance. Yeah, no, I think the same, a fear and then a little bit angry because you know this happens, but you know, the feeling of just being uh, unnervingly unsettling. The first part during around March, April was kind of sadness, loneliness. Um, and then further down the pandemic, you kind of find a groove. And then I guess once we got the, then there was the hopefulness that the vaccines were coming. Once I got the vaccine, there was a little breath of fresh air, a little bit more, I felt more comfortable. You know, loneliness, um, sense of uh, loss from the community. Um, but, you know, also, you know, perseverance and, you know, we're going to get through this. So you've seen like... Uh, how human beings can kind of come together um, behind a cause and you know it's crazy that we're still in it but we're on the way I feel like to ending it so yeah. Some confusion, um, some loss of freedom and then I guess grateful to be healthy. Definitely um, a lot of nervousness, a bit of anxiousness about um, what is going on and what will be going on going forward in the future. Um, also a bit of relief, surprisingly, from um, things closing down initially. I was able to stay at home and rest more than I normally would. So that surprised me, but those were two different feelings that I experienced. Oh, I think I've worried more about other people. I think I've fortunately done okay, but it's definitely, I feel it's changed me. I'm more in touch with my introvert side than I used to be. And for me, that's been a good thing. 